Zakaro Control, this is SSV Normandy. Are we clear to descend? Zakaro Control, this is Normandy. We're headed to Bay 14, Zakaro Ward. Are we clear to descend? What the hell's going on down there? Even if there were a station malfunction, they'd have backups online. I got a bad feeling here. Checking emergency channels. Hey, yeah, this is Joker. Uh-huh. Yeah, no kidding. Commander, there's a communication from Thane. He says it's important. I think you'll want to hear this. Put him through. Shepard, the Citadel is under attack. Cerberus troops are everywhere, and they're in control of the docks. Are you safe? No. I had to evade their commandos at the hospital. I'm in a Presidium storefront. Did Caden make it out? We got separated. He said he had to protect the Council. I'm going to CSEC headquarters. Why CSEC headquarters? It's been compromised, and CSEC's response depends on it. As long as Cerberus is holding the headquarters, they have the station. All right. Joker, get us away from the docks and close to CSEC HQ. We'll deploy in the shuttle. Aye, aye, Commander.
Shepard, I saw those Cerberus troops on you. I thought you were done for. Bailey, what are you doing here? Getting my ass shot off trying to retake headquarters. Cerberus took it in the first push. We gotta kick them out of there. Everyone in C-Sec's flying blind without the network. How bad's the situation? Do you know if the counselors are alive? They split up. I'll know more if I can access the terminal inside. Can you get us in? I'll get the door. If no one interrupts me with a bullet this time. Here we go, CSET network access, courtesy of Cerberus. How's that gonna help? Cerberus has control of the main channels, but I can set up a new one. Without it, our people have no plan and no chance. Hello. What have you got? A warning from Counselor Ashiel. She's supposed to be here meeting with the Executor. This move may provoke retaliation. Well, that's an understatement. If she's inside, she's in trouble. Why would the Counselor be meeting with the Executor? Usually it means someone big's about to be prosecuted. I guess that someone had Cerberus friends. The Counselor mentioned Udina. But that's insane. Does he even have this kind of pull? Well, you know who'd have the answer to that? The Counselor. The Counselor's in there, surrounded by Cerberus? Who put together that security detail? Well, until an hour ago, this place was as safe as it got. Nobody expected something on this scale. We need to find the Counselor and get her out of here. She has got to know more about who's behind this. The Counselor could be in the Executor's office. It's a fairly defensible position. I'm on it. Just a sec. There. Now we can talk by Omnitool. Go. Hey, did you hear all that? Yes. I'm nearing the building, but running is difficult. I'll try to get to you. Troops in the lobby. They were dug in. I can see more through the cameras. They're all over the station. Entry wounds in the back of the head. 
Looks like a surprise, not an execution. We've got hardcore traders here. Same as Mars. Cerberus sure like sleeper agents. Didn't even drag him out into the hall. Gunfire doesn't put them on notice. I sure won't.
gotta be close now. Yeah, there's a stairwell further on. Executor's office is right above it. Let's hope we're not too late. Bailey, looks like they got the executor and two Solarian bodyguards. Damn. All right, keep searching. If you don't see the counselor's body, don't count her out yet. Found her. She looks unharmed. Get her somewhere safe. Don't even think about it. Shepard, he's going to kill us all. That remains to be seen. I mean Udina. He's staging a coup. The other counselors are headed for a trap. Three on one, pal. It's over. No. No, it's fun. How bad is it? I have time. Catch him. Shepard, what's going on up there? Thane needs medical help fast, and I need to take care of an assassin. 
He must be going after the rest of the council. Get the word out. Odina's trying to seize power. I've got to get to the councillors. They're being taken to a shuttle pad on the Presidium. Start driving. I'll try to raise them on the comm. I've got a fix on the council's position. I'm sending it to your car. Good work, Bailey. We're almost there. <laughs> I'm on foot now. Any luck contacting the council? Negative. Their guards are dead. But we've still got vital signs on the council's transponders. Where are they going? The shuttle pad above Shalmar Plaza. Odin is with them. If he can get them in range of them. An assassin, this is all over. On my way.
sealed it behind them. Where's the council? In an elevator. They're trying to get to the shuttle. Doc, someone's following them. Someone with a sword. Great. Okay, I'm in the shaft. Hang on, this will be a fast climb. Tell me that assassin hasn't reached the council. He's trying, but I'm making his elevator stop on every floor. Nice. I found our friend. Kill his elevator. There's a power conduit beneath it. Other kind? That hitman jumped to another elevator and he's overridden my controls. He's on his way up, I can't stop him. I'll handle it. Here they come! I see them. Jump! That was a person. Go! Get down! Ah! 
He's with Cerberus. Just hang on. I got this. Everyone calm down. You're not the one I want, Caden. It's the man behind you. What are you talking about? Put the gun away. Shepard admitted to working with Cerberus. For all we know, he's still with them. But I watched Shepard fight Cerberus troops on Mars. Now explain that. There are Cerberus soldiers in the elevator shaft behind us. If you open that door, they'll kill you all. What Shepard says is possible. Unlikely, but possible. We don't have time to debate this. We're dead if we stay out here. I'm overriding the lock. Shepard, look at us. <sighs> this can't end well. Just... put... it down. You know in your gut that I'm right. Listen to it. Caden, you're always true to what you believe. I admire that about you. Listen to your gut. Udina, step away from the console. To hell with this! He's got a gun! Get the council back and cover that door. The door! Bailey? Made it as fast as we could, Shepard. Looks like you uh, took care of things. Then it's true. We were in danger. But I don't understand. You said Cerberus was right here. Cerberus was right here, but they beat feet into the Keeper Tunnels when they figured out we were coming. Sorry, Counselor, I'll say it plain. Shepard just saved the lot of you. Then I owe you, Shepard, for our lives and for brokering a deal with the Primarch of the Krogan that I never could. Too bad it took this to get you on board. We will not make that same mistake again. Shepard, do you have any idea why Cerberus would do this? Honestly? No. But I plan to find out. All right, people. Principals are evacuated. We got a tunnel and a million more places to secure. Move it. Yes? Things didn't go as planned. The Council's still in control of the Citadel and Udina's dead. Udina was expendable. Now what? There are other plans in motion. I'll fill you in when you return. I'm surprised you let Shepard get the better of you, Ling. It won't happen again. Mm hmm. We'll see. We looked over every centimeter of those tunnels, Shepard. Your Cerberus pal is made out of smoke and mirrors. He likes to fight. He'll show up again. Pardon me if I'm not reassured by that. We can't even get an ID on him. He released a VI into the Citadel system that erased footage of him wherever he went. I guess he didn't trust that Udina's plan would come together. That reminds me, we got your friend Thane into work to Memorial. He's in for surgery. Apparently, uh, there's complications. Do you think he'll make it? I caught that they didn't have much drug blood on the Citadel. I notified his next of kin, his son, Koliat. He was the right blood type, but I don't know if he made it in time. We're pretty sure the route to the hospital is safe from Cerberus, if you want to see him. Uh, I'd go now. I'll get on it. Oh, and you can tell him the Salarian counselor says he's a hero. It just, uh, I don't know make things easier for him? 
Uh, so many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us. All that time you were working for Adina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead. And you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Udina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. How does the Citadel fit into the war now? Uh, the war finally found us. This is so far beyond our imagination, and we have been trained to expect the unexpected. Since the coup attempt, folks are shutting down and shutting in. I hear a lot of praying. And crying. They're saying this is the war to end all wars. Well, I haven't seen anything to say they aren't right. Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action, they've got another thing coming. No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah, you too, Shepard. This is a problem, boss. Cerberus has changed their ciphers, and our codebreakers aren't getting anywhere. I've got our best team working in shape. My wife was just sent back to active duty, and I'm about to get shipped out too. I was hoping my deal was going to be there. Damn it. How are we supposed to do this? No? Well, then nothing else can be doing our fleet, and the sorry world will keep burning. No, I'm serious. 
Seeing it here soon. Low on Metatron. Welcome to Serta. Serta is a non-profit organization dedicated to the makers of all sapient life. Can I help you? I'm looking for a Drell named Thane Krios. Well, we have a Drell, but not under that name. He was injured. Stab wound. He's a regular patient here. It's all right, it's all right. I see. The doctors were able to repair a lot of the trauma. However, Mr. Hmm. Krios is in the final stages of Keppel Syndrome. At its worst, Keppel Syndrome interferes with his blood's ability to carry oxygen. And he lost a lot. Now, they've given him transfusions, but frankly, there was a very limited supply of Drell blood on the Citadel. I'll get more. Give me his blood type. That's not going to work. Only one other Drell on the station is a match, and that Drell is in with him now. We did all we could to help him through surgery, but his body can't replace lost blood with new cells. Too much shock. His son, Koliat, he's in there saying his goodbyes. You might want to say yours. Commander Shepard, my father mentioned you were no longer incarcerated. I don't know if you remember me. I'm Koliak Krios. I came to donate blood and, well, he asked me to take off his oxygen mask so he could be comfortable. I don't think it will be very long. Your father helped me save a lot of lives. I'd like to be here. Of course. Commander, I'm afraid I won't be joining you again. You've done more than enough, Thane. That assassin should be embarrassed. A terminally ill Drell managed to stop him from reaching his target. I'll pass the word along. There is something I must do before it gets worse. I must... Mistress of inscrutable depths, I ask forgiveness. Kalihira, whose waves wear down stone and sand. <coughs> Kalihira, wash the sins from this one and set him on the distant shore of the infinite spirit. Koliad, <coughs> you speak as the priests do. You have been spending time with them. I brought a prayer book. Commander, would you care to join me? Kalahira, this one's heart is pure, but beset by wickedness and contention. Guide this one to where the traveler never tires, the lover never leaves, the hungry never starve. Guide this one, Kalahira. And he will be a companion to you as he was to me. Call yet? There's something I don't understand. His last moments were those of a hero. Why pray for salvation? The prayer was not for him, Commander. He has already asked forgiveness for the lives he has taken. His wish was for you. Goodbye, Thane. You won't be alone long. sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. 
And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore an oath to help the sick regardless of their economic situations or their places in society. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? Everyone makes sacrifices in wartime. You'll make yours sooner or later. I'm sure I will. But I'll do it without betraying my oath or my patience. It's not that simple. If we aren't careful about this now, we'll end up losing everyone. Then we'll find a way. Look, we have more fortunate patients, right? Yes. And I hate to say it, but the fortunate ones have far better survival odds. <laughs> and more credits. So we ask them for donations to get more supplies for those without credits. What? Are you saying what I think you're saying? That's... You know, that, that actually might work. This sucks. What have you got there? Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They've got us spread out across Alliance units. Reinforcing barriers, modding ammo, that kind of thing. How are they holding up? They are fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave. Complain if you like, but I think military life suits you. Hey, running back to the Alliance was your lifelong dream, not mine. Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah, maybe your little suicide squad taught me something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. My guys are handling the support stuff well. Still see some action, but they're not on the front lines. They've saved a lot of lives. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights. But the little shits are useless without me. I gotta stick with them. Cause I'm dependable now, apparently. I blame you for this, Shepard. Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. Bird. Everybody knows you can't dance. technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it.
can't wait until I'm back on duty. The Hesperia period. Their statues have legendarily accurate books. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal. Please. Exports. We believe that we a peaceful heart, heart is a strong heart. Can't believe how hard the doctors are working to keep them terrorist bastards alive. Yeah, blasted by serpents. They think he's just a victim. If he's a terrorist, he ought to be locked up. Shot. Gorex wanted for six bodies. Six. Killed both humans and materials. He's come to own people. Major Kaden Alenko, the second human specter, assisted Commander Shepard in preventing Cerberus forces mm -hmm. from killing. Damn it. Another Cerberus trap? Bomb or turret? How many this time? Mm -hmm. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find a little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. All my security vids bring me a warrant. You still calling me? Those vids could be vital to the war effort. I doubt the Reapers have agents doing business in my cafe. We're trying to protect you. Now the Jockey. See those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thanks, Max. I have some high profile customers. Word gets out that I'm ratting them out to CSEC. You think I care about insider trading? Electronic monitoring? Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Proceeds from all purchases go to help our men and women serving in the Alliance. For the best in the business, come to Casa. All goods have been marked down with our special wartime discount. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Need should you. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. Thank you for shopping at Nosastra Sporting Goods. People have a right to defend themselves. If you start selling weapons to everyone in the Citadel, CSEC will shut this whole place down. CSEC couldn't protect us when Cerberus attacked. I'll take him to court. You think a court is going to want more people running with guns right now? Would a bunch of civilians shooting at anything that moves make the Citadel safer? The commander's right. Maybe if the Council organizes a civilian militia with training. Otherwise, they'll just panic and get themselves killed. I just... I just want people to be safe. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Second-guessing CSEC isn't the way. What if we submit a proposal to start a militia? Remember, all purchases welcome to Cipertine Armory. We By appreciate being welcome to Cipertine Armory. Thank you for shopping at Cipertine Armory as AM Trading Limited. Commander Shepard, do you have a minute? Can I help you? Jordan Knowles, E-Crimes. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. I've got a saboteur hacking key systems. Power, communications. It's bad. 
If you've got time to help, check out this console. Got it. it. Looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes, from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can shut them down. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the embassy. If I find anything, I'll let you know. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the asshole's in custody. Killing him won't bring anyone back. It's about justice. What's going on here? I'm in position at CSEC. Draw them away, and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. to keep enforcing the law. Same as always. Without that, everything goes to hell. Look at Palavin, my friend. We're in hell. We should be looking for terrorists. The rest will take care of itself. So the bar fight? Commander Shepard. Guess I know what happened to my backup. Excuse me? Come on. I'm in C-Sec in civilian gear with a weapon. I know when I'm made. Just let me explain. Captain Aaron Summers, Alliance Marines, retired. Captain Summers? There's a prisoner here. CSEC officer who helped Cerberus. CSEC caught him when you stopped the coup. Now he's offering them intel on Cerberus to get a better deal. Why are you telling me this? Because he doesn't deserve a better deal. He killed people during the coup. Good people. And he's former Alliance, like us. The way I figure it, he's our problem to fix. Officer, I'm Commander Shepard. You have a prisoner here? A Cerberus informant? I'm invoking Spectre authority to take charge of him. Do what you have to do. Thank you, Commander. We have to keep enforcing the law. Same as always. Without that, everything goes to hell. Look at Paladin, my friend. We're in hell. We should be looking for terrorists. The rest can take care of itself. So the bar fights, the drunken disorderlies down by that purgatory place? How does cracking down on that crack help us win the war? People need to blow up. Everyone on the Citadel knows we're at war now. You have to show them that CSEC is still in control. They need that security. The commander's right. We need people coming into work every day. We need things to keep running. Otherwise, today's bar fight could be tomorrow's street riot. Yeah, maybe you're right. Alex needs to understand what these refugees have been through. Can't you let me in? No. I only need a couple of hours of footage. You're not crossing that dock. Wait, aren't you Commander Shepard? Solik Vas, documentary maker. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifices, their moments of bravery. Something holding you back? CSEC won't allow me on the docks. They say I'd be disruptive. But you could catch a few quick shots for me. There are lots of refugees on the rest of the Citadel. It won't have the same impact as seeing crowds trapped on the docks. We all need to help each other. I want this documentary to shock people into action. Good idea. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. If you could just take a few shots with your Omni-Tool in the refugee camp. I'll be here when you're done.
you okay? I've just been standing here, holding this for I don't know how long. He'll always be a part of me. Your past is yours. No one can take that away. Bye, Robert. You give me strength. Thank you. I just need a few moments to myself. so far can I talk to him only if it's important commander he's hurt bad take down the sedative a bit but hurry I peg his survival at 50 50 are you Gorek <sighs> go away nothing to say not even what a terrorist is doing on the Citadel you do I know you <laughs> Someone on Eratok remembers your face. The planet that got caught in the Alpha Relay explosion. You butcher the colony. Only regret. <laughs> Don't have the strength to. <sighs> I destroyed Eratot's relay to stop the Reapers from pouring through. <laughs> Easy for you to claim now that they're here. Don't pretend you have any remorse. You think I didn't feel guilty? I destroyed a colony. I've thought about the people who died. About how I couldn't warn them in time. In the end, I didn't have a choice. But I'm sorry. If that means anything. <laughs> if you're so remorseful... <clears throat> if you have any real guilt, show some mercy. <laughs> Unplug this machine. Let me join my family. Oh. Support. Someone sabotaged the metagel dispensers, and I've got some idiot preaching about Cerberus down here. No, I've contacted him. That's not a priority that doesn't matter. Are you kidding me? I believe those are my credits. Hey, Commander. James, enjoying yourself? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Try not to lose everything. Those clothes are a line's property. I have a little faith, loco. I have a little. You thought I was bluffing, didn't you? Great shot, Commander. Listen, please, we just need more food. I can give you the location of some ruins. Protheon, on Gay Hidden, about the time. Nexus. Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with Arya.
I've fixed the sabotage. The metagel dispensers should be working now. Thank you. I'll get patients moving through triage immediately. Great work, Shepard. And listen, I'm sorry for... Hey, that's him. That's my Cerberus contact. Hey, hey, you! You're under arrest. I sabotaged his gun. It might have looked like it fired, but that was just the thermal clip overheating. Hi, Commander. It's me, Jenna. You helped me a few years ago when I was working undercover at Cora's Den. And now you're volunteering here. Right. Chalik showed me a few little tricks when he had me working undercover. Guess that paid off, huh? You... you saved my life. I can't believe you were willing to lay down your life for Commander Shepard. You're so brave. Oh, the Commander and I go way back. Let me give you a hand, and I can tell you about it. Have your footage. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away.
I've got your briefing, Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. The Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. It's a low-gravity planet, toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? I had a friend in security at Sonax, and there was definitely Prothean tech on no Garlock. I know the Valhalla threshold is Reaper territory now, but Prothean tech could help the cruise. No, ma'am. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Yes, Kate. Hey, I wondered where you went. What's up? I'm trying to wrap my head around what just happened. You sound angry. No, just not used to staring down the gun of someone I've worked with so closely. I went on one down, and it's got me... I don't know. Okay. Talk to me. Let's have it. If I hadn't backed down first, I feel like you would have taken me out. Doesn't matter. It could have played out a dozen different ways. Main thing is, we stopped the coup, and Cerberus is off the Citadel. Yeah, but sometimes the way a thing goes down does matter, Shepard. Later, when you have to live with yourself, knowing that you acted with integrity, and it matters. You're talking about Adina. He gave me no choice, so I took the shot. Any soldier would have done the same, including you. Okay. Look, Shepard, there's, uh... There's another reason I'm here. Hackett offered me a position, but I'd turn it down in a second if there was a chance to join you in the Normandy again. Couldn't imagine meeting the Reapers without you. <sighs> Thank you, Commander. And Shepard, I need you to know that I'll never doubt you again. I get you back. Good to know. Welcome aboard, Major. Aye, aye, sir. Shepard, I got Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Udina? That SOB was always power-hungry. But this? He wasn't in charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the Citadel. What the hell for? I don't know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Counselor Ashiel. Kyline. What? Your assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. I take it you two have met. Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. I shot him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But it should have begun on Omega, even stronger. Elusive man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson, it's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. I don't care who he is. Next time we meet, he dies. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari Counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Mm. Yes, the Asari and Solarians are both throwing in their support now. How's your progress on the Crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So quickly? Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean-specific. Hmm. Are we any closer to understanding how to use it? That's still open for debate. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is, how will it dispense the energy, and in what form? You mean, how do you stop it from wiping us all out? Exactly. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. I'll send you an update on the schematics. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. You've always trusted me. I won't let you down. We're still in this. The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. Good luck, both of you. Anderson out. Commander, the Tyrian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. And the Quarians are willing to talk. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Be careful. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. Shepard, do you have a moment? A contact within Asari High Command was insistent I pass on a distress signal to you. 
Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on this? That they wouldn't ask for help if it wasn't important. The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. I'll try to figure out what's going on. Mm -hmm.